Let's go. Okay, good game. I got the comeback, but I almost choked it. Yo, story time, part five, or episode five, not part. Anyways, for those of you guys who are new, basically, I just talk about a story while playing ladder. Today, I'll be playing top 300 ladder, so there's more stakes on the line, I guess. But I don't give a shit. Still gonna just play it casually. We're using MK Loon, like usual. And today's story is gonna be the first time I finished top 1K and got my first, like, top 1K badge, I guess. I miss old ladder, man. Now we have this shitty version but it is what it is gonna just talk about the good old days all right at the time uh finishing top 1k had pretty big implications meaning that you actually got something because of it instead of just a badge i finished i think the first uh the first month of 2021 which was quite nice let me arrow this real quick but basically 2021 was the first year where they started doing uh open crl don't know if that makes sense, but let me explain. Basically, people were invited to CRL if they finished top 1K throughout the whole year. So you got a whole ass year uh, to try to compete in CRL. And I finished in the first month, which was sick. So I was invited, but then I was kicked out because I had a bitch ass age requirement. So that was bullshit because I was hella excited for that. But I don't even remember. I think the age requirement at the time was 16 or something like that. I remember getting like the invitation on my account and going through like a link and i was like hella excited and everything there was like this one website too where like you see everyone else who finished top 1k join the thing but i got kicked out but i did find out that during that time i don't know if it's still true now but during that time i was the youngest to participate or not to participate to i guess to like qualify that's the word i was looking for i was lighting that by the way don't like that bomb tower no yet that why does he have a rocket? I don't even know. So yeah, that was quite nice, but what sucked is that I couldn't compete because I think there was like a really uh, big grand total number of earnings that you could potentially get. Not that I would have, all right? I was a dumb little 13-year-old kid. I definitely would not have won anything, but hey, I had hopes. Not high hopes, but they were hopes. Lightning. Yes. Okay, we win. Uh, That will be... Oh, please mk come on now Fuck! all right well god damn it that's annoying we caused minor it doesn't even matter we just need a lightning i swear to god if he catches this lightning with like goblins i'm gonna be so pissed oh never mind he gave up okay well even if he catches it i still have arrows so it doesn't matter ggs and i'll talk more about how i actually finished in the next match all right uh so now let's talk about the actual finish i finished top 833 in the world here are two pictures right now. Uh, basically, I used my MK Loon deck, this exact variant, but instead of Knight, I used Valk. Or what the fuck did I just say? Instead of Valk, I used Knight, because at the time, that's uh, a lot better with the meta, a faster cycle. There wasn't a lot of like swarm you had to deal with, if I recall correctly. That's probably the case, or else I wouldn't have. Actually, I was pretty under leveled at that time. We're well, not under leveled, but I was. I had like no high leveled cards so i couldn't really what the fuck hog got two hits i sworn it's only supposed to get one with that mk placement but don't really give a shit please not mini horde or something like that e whiz okay oh he's got um he's got mega knight right if i remember right okay well let's go valkyrie holy shit Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I'm so stupid. He's going to go hog, right? But yeah, the cool thing is that I skipped over a top 900 finish and immediately just got a top 800, so that was cool. I'm not going to go for king here because I'm really low on elixir. The badges looked a lot cooler back then, and I was, like, a lot more dedicated to getting them. If you guys remember, you could have three ladder badges on your profile. It's the top three and three uh, global tournament badges. I was trying to get all six of them. But then they change it up, obviously. Now it looks a lot worse than before. What the? Let's go Tesla. That was a really goofy placement, but it really worked. Damn. I just realized something. That's going to splash on my Tesla, right? It doesn't, but... Um... Let's go Hunter like this. Archers like this. Tesla like this. I think that Hog's just for bait. I don't think he's actually trying to get damage on that side. Anyways, I really do miss the old Clash Route. 
I think that might be why I was more addicted because it looked a lot nicer, I guess. The visuals really do play a role. Like, actually. I think I win. Yeah, good game. I kind of counter because he doesn't really have much for my balloon, but GG's. They kind of killed the fun in top ladder. Uh, now, don't get me wrong. Top ladder is not fun at all. What I kind of meant was that the new ladder system is fucking bullshit. I'd rather have like the joy in hitting 8k trophies. I think they just want a lot of people to progress. Anyways, let's MK this. And dude, you guys don't even want me to go into the shop offers. That shit is a straight up scam. Okay, let's arrow that. I was going to go bloom, but I knew he had mini hordes, so I didn't do it. He's going to goblin game behind it, probably. Is he not? Oh, there you go. Maybe it was low on elixir. I don't know. I'm gonna go archers. Don't wanna go Val because he. I think he has ice going back, so you can just pull it other lane. Get good elixir value. I think he's got bats as well. He's running giant, I think. So I cycle Valk now because I think I'm up a lot of elixir. I'm gonna try to get this tower here. Ignore the pump. It's kind of risky, but if he goes 3M, I can lightning. If he goes bats, I can hunter. Okay, well, uh, I don't know how I feel about that. He doesn't have that in rotation anymore, but I don't know. Let's actually go MK. I don't know what he- Oh, Bandit, what the fuck? Is he gonna go in here? Oh, he's got that, okay. Uh, I gotta snipe this immediately. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh shit. Okay, we get the tower. Uh, if we get the tower, we just win, because I can defend this shit really easily, even if he has a pump. Yeah, even if he has two pumps. There's 40 seconds left. There's no way. Come on, where is it? Is he not going to do it? Bro is not cycling a 3M. Oh, yeah, I think he knows I'm going to get really good value if he does. There you go. Uh, okay, that's fine. Uh, I just need an arrow. Okay, well, he doesn't have enough time, so good game to this guy. And another hard counter for me. GG's. I'm gonna go kind of off topic for my main topic, which is hitting 1k, top 1k for the first time. Since there's not much to say, except for, like, I beat a lot of top players. I think the match that secured it, I beat the number two guy in the world. We're sorry, that, that was phrased really weirdly. I beat someone who finished number two in the world. Boof and Mac, I do remember that. He was running, he was running Royal Hawk Cycle, so yeah, of course I hard counter him. It, it was still a little harder, because I had uh, Knight instead of Valk, so uh, it was a bit harder. And I almost lost, I'm pretty sure, but I didn't, so all that matters. Hunter, let's go Tesla like this. Okay, fair enough. How the fuck is that alive? Yeah, I'm gonna go off topic a little. Is he gonna go cannon? Rocket, what the fuck? Oh, hell no. Yeah, but Clash has been adding a bunch of new stuff. I don't know where they're really going at. And honestly, I don't even know what kind of an update I really want anymore. Just kind of seeing what the game does and just going with it, I guess. Uh, Hunter. One, two, three. Okay. This dies. I don't know. How do I do this? He's got Rocket. I don't like playing decks with Rocket. Let's do this. Please. Okay, fuck. Let's go test like this. All right, we caught. Ah, uh, kind of caught it. Um, what if I just go opposite? I'm gonna try to win this one. Um, let's go Valk. I need my MK to break through because I obviously can't use my balloon. Die, please. Oh, I should have pre-arrowed. I thinking about it okay we got some damage there let's go tesla again i really hope he rockets this archers let's go mk like this again okay uh okay i'm gonna go valk distract the bomb tower i want to lightning this so die and then let's go blue like this he's probably gonna bomb tower this actually But I can arrow. Oh, that splashes. No shot. So he's going to have to rock it or... Oh, okay. He can do that. Oh, and he's got that. I forgot about that. Let's go test like this again. Just kind of like a minor killer. That sounded hella weird, but... Ooh. Oh, he might rock it this. He doesn't. Uh, 
Let's go, Mega Knight. Just do the same thing and just see what he like switches up on. Hunter like this. Uh, okay. We're close to winning, but we're not quite. I know for a fact he's got roll delivery, but let's go balloon. Oh, he's pulling it away. That's really good. Hold on. No way we got the MK drum. Let's go. This guy's ass, bro. Um. Oh, shit. Wait, I haven't even won yet. What am I doing? What am I saying? Okay, now we won. Unless he cycled back to another one. He has Godwin's back, doesn't he? Yep. Let's go. Okay, good game. That was actually a lot closer than I thought. I got the comeback, but I almost choked it. So, yeah. GG. All right, we'll do one more. And we're against Big Jasp. I think I know who this is. I think... Oh, he does have the Brazilian flag on his clan. So, maybe not. So, if he's running e giant, then I'm thinking of the right guy. But, yeah. When I finished top 8-3-3, that was the season where that was a finish before... I got banned because I finished top 8 through 3. Then after, not the next season, I think a couple seasons after, I wasn't super consistent with top 1Ks. But like the next time I finished top 1K was the season that I got banned. I finished top 9 for 1 and then I got banned after. Bullshit ass super sub. Well, it's double elixir. We're leaking. So it just cycle on MK. Okay, yeah, I think I'm wrong. I don't think he's running E Giant. It could be Graveyard or Royal Giant. Oh, yep. Archers. Oh, he's got Fisherman, yeah. Shit. No, why didn't it hit the Roll Giant? Oh, shit. Okay, uh, I fucked up a lot. Because the Lightning did hit the Roll Giant, so it wasn't stunned, so it didn't lock on to the Tesla. See, I kind of fucked up there, but we might be able to come back. I was saying might, because he has Fireball, which, eh, it's not bad, but... Oh, try to predict Fisherman. Yes, we got it. No way. Oh, he missed. Bro, sucks. Where's his... I'm gonna predict his Mother Witch. No, I missed. Okay. Let's go Valk like this, because this tower is a lot more, like, not healthy. Let's arrow that. I think that kills a Mother Witch. It does. Let's go Balloon. Oh, this is risky. Yeah, this is really risky. Wait, actually, no. He's gonna have to go Tombstone. It's not bad at all. Oh, I'm giving a fireball value here, but Valk, Valk's good. Valk's really good. Arrow that. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, that's that's a lot of damage. Now that I think about it, uh, he's gonna have to pull it with a tombstone. Okay, well that's not horrible because I only need one more lightning, but still, Hunter. Tesla, okay. Ah! This is a nut buster for sure. I got a. Oh, okay. So you try to predict. I don't think you can do anything else, right? Yeah. GG's, and that'll be the last match. We're getting a lot of plus 26s, so that's kind of annoying. But hope you guys enjoyed this one, this story time. I only talked about it for like two to three matches and it just kind of went sideways. But yeah, my commentary is kind of ass. Sorry about that. Anyways. Bye-bye.